Mix the gold with filtered water and a binder. You could either use gelatin or gum arabic. I'm just using gum arabic because it's there. And the binder makes the gold stick on the paper. Add a drop of water to the gold and only one drop at a time because you don't want the gold's intensity to be affected with it being too wet. So you're just adding one drop at a time after it dries. You might notice that painting with the gold is slightly different than painting with watercolors and other types. And it's just, it has this beautiful texture when you're moving the gold slowly. Gold is also considered one of the most majestic materials, that's why you start painting with it first without adding anything else. You should place a paper under your, your hand when you're painting because you don't want to erase some of the gold that you've already painted. After you're done with painting with the gold, you need to burnish it and I use an agate um, tool to just rub the gold and that makes it really shine. The agate material is very soft so when you're burnishing it, the gold doesn't get affected and you're not ruining what you've just painted. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you found the video useful. Make sure you subscribe for more Islamic illumination videos. Please share any questions you might have in the comments below.